Oh yeah, one um one thing I have noticed the slight change they made to the bonus stages in Crash Free other than the music is they also now tell you how many boxes are in the bonus stages compared to um, the bonus stage in 2 where they would just tell you how many boxes you'd collected just in general as well as it did that on the regular levels as well and this this would be the standard going forward then into Rafa Cortex but how do I get that box up there? It's a slide and I think it's a slide and double jump. Let's try it. Slide, jump, jump, boom. Easy. Three, four, boom. One, two, three, four, five. Right, and this game also introduced the five bounce um, count on the one before box as well. I think in Crash 2 and. I don't think they have them in Crash 1. I don't think they have them in Crash 1. Um, but yeah, I think it, that, that it's 10 or 8 jumps in Crash 2, well in this, from this game onwards it's always 5. Even Crash 1's about time had the mercy to keep it at 5. <laughs> into the fire. Cast it into the fire! Ooh, we've unlocked the death route. Yeah, go on, let's do the death route. Therefore we can go back to the... Uh, tomb level and do that other level so we can get the clear gem. Uh, I'm immediately. <laughs> just the sudden up tempo of the music makes me already regret this decision. Right. Uh, it shouldn't be too hard. This, it's not like this is Crash 4, it's about time or anything. <laughs> Oh, what? Oh, that was bullshit. Bloody side scrolling messing with my perspectives. Right, so that again. Okay, that's like another minor complaint, but that, that complaint can be, honestly, and that was just stupidity on my behalf. <laughs> um, um, what was I saying? Ah, yeah. Um, the side-scrolling bits can be a bit deceiving in terms of your placement it, from the foreground to the background. It, that's literally like a... Um, a Dougal moment from Father Ted. These are small and those are far away. Right. Right. I'm determined though. We're gonna get this purple gem and then we might go back to the tomb area and do the rest and get the clear gem for that level. I don't know why I didn't die there, but I'm not going to question it. Oof. Oh, come on. Oof. There we go. Let's not make this in. See, I, it's hard to tell where he's placed because I'm constantly pressing right and he's just stuck in the same spot. It's very confusing like that. Confused! Confusion. Right. Okay, so, I don't know what difference I did this time, but it, it classified me as being on it this time. Right. Let's go. 
I pressed double. Oh, and there was the purple gem. Oh, fuck off. Well, that is uh, quite a death horse. Yeah, it is. Um. So overall, it's not it's not a very long death route. I'd say it's intermediately challenged. It's, it's, this is this is classic trial and error for this game. Like, with the exception of Crash Run, like two and three, and um, yeah, I, I I'll give it the benefit of the doubt. Even Rapid Cortex is fun to 110 percent, with some exceptions. Um, like, I just have absolutely no motivation to, um, it's the best about that again. I just have absolutely no, I, I haven't even completed Crash 4, it's about time yet. And a part of me is just like, why? <laughs> you know? And, um... Come on, you burk. There we go. Oh, you too. camera now because it's not too far off. Oh, I wasn't concentrating on the game. That seems to be a running theme through this playthrough. Just get too caught up in past rages of Crash 4, it's about time. Or technical difficulties. Right. Um, I'm determined to get this purple jam. Like, I am hellbent on it now. I'm making the same stick again. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Right. Into the fire! Let's, let's just take our time. Hurry up on this monkey bar. Come on. You know what? I'm gonna be animal cruelty free today. Actually, no, I'm going to kill this one. Crash free today to see if I still can. Ugh. I know what jam's gonna be playing in my head tonight <laughs> at 3 a.m. Oh, no, 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 no. Gosh, the amount of times I st still make that same mistake. <sighs> right, I, for the life of me, cannot figure out the perspective on this bloody monkey bar area. It, it, it just kind of feels like sheer luck. Oh, that actually hurt my chest. Ugh. We will do this.
all I'm going to be thinking about later is bloody monkey bars and scorpions. Oh. Right, okay. I'm doing a free attempt rule on. If we don't complete it, after free attempt, we're going to skip it. <laughs> camera reached its max recording time then. But yeah, um, I don't know if it caught that at the end of the ad. Okay, we're narrowing it down now to three more attempts and if I don't get it on the third attempt then we'll just continue on the regular level because I sense some inner frustration building up inside of me. The annoying thing is, we can we we almost reached the end of the level. It's just really fucking bizarre. Die! There we go. Never thought these scorpions would and platforms would give me so much grief. I think it's shard, yeah. So it's a shard though that gives it away, but it's very subtle. Right. Ah, oh, finally. We did it. Woo! Hells to the yeah. Yeah, that first you don't succeed, Mr. Kid. Right. Try again until you reach quick. Do the hustle. Right. So now, let's go back to the other tomb level and we can have a look and get in the clear gem. Right. Um, where is it? Here we go. Oh, let's tomb again. Like we did last tomb. Crash, Coco, if you have already retrieved a Level's Crystal, then you will find a floating clock when you enter for the second time. This floating clock activates time trial mode. Grab it and the clock will start ticking. Race for the end to get the best time. But beware, some elements will change. I don't like change! Yeah, but that's basically Yaku Aku explaining the concept of the time trials. But we're here for a different purpose. Get out of here. I think once you've completed the purple gem area in this level, you then have to backtrack, which can be a bit of a ball ache. But now that we got the um, double jump power up, hopefully this level will be quite a bit easier. And we can use that double jump to our advantage. Easy as E equals MC squared. Oof, nearly overshot that jump. Oh. Right. 
go, I think it's by here. Here we go, right. Yes, it's unlocked. Right. Right. Ooh, I'm already feeling the pressure. by Mr. Wanna be Kurt Russell in the thing with this flamethrower. Oh! I have never seen that death cam before. That is legit the first time I've ever been killed by these the spikes in the floor. They actually low-key creep me out. The facial expression on Crash's face. This guy is a menace. I don't know what triggers it, but if you die like so many times consecutively, I do think the game rewards you with like a, a standard Aqua Aqua Master Assist you, which is very handy for when you're doing death routes. Right. Uh, well, get out of here. Yeah. Oh, you son of a bitch. Let me slip a Sam your way. Uh. Oh no. Pathetic. Right. <sighs> oh boy. That is. Oh, I just realized we're going to go activate that switch. See how long it stays open for. Oh, I can see the jam. Okay, it stays open for enough time to accomplish it. Whew! Done it. Right, got the secret jam. Lovely. So now begins the long, long backtracking. Uh, this isn't going to be fun. Hopefully there's a checkpoint not too far away. Hey buddy, what you doing there? Man, if I take you for a spin? Yeah, there is. Okay. Right. Oh, thank God. 
There we go. Right. Let's continue on with our backtrack. Not too many more now. Oh! Whew. Stared the bees out of me. Oh! And a bit. Well, luckily, we're very close. That is so, it's like, it's it's easy to do going forward, but go, going backwards with that is an absolute pain in the rectum. I can't see what's. I can't even remember from muscle memory what's. Right here. Oh, I can just about make out the platform. Come back here. Right. Whew. Right. Three boxes left. Right. There we go. Now all we gotta do is get to the end of the area. Done. Let's just go finish the level. Hopefully we won't die. It's always these bits with the traps that always catch me off guard. Not today, Sunny Jim. Right, let's with haste, let us make our way to the end of the level. last 20 minutes we have got a total of three gems including a colored one which was nice right. boom do the double crash hustle lovely stuff not my words michael the words are shaken statements um, the Laxal is definitely a race level for memory. And there it is. Right, so I think, um, okay, we'll try and just get the gem the first time and then get the crystal the second time around, like we did with the previous racing level. Right. Let's go, 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 go! I can't remember if it's this level where you hit the road sign to unlock the alien level. Or it might be the next one after this, but... How many boxes are there this level? 25. I can drive 25. Oh, there it is. Boom. We've unlocked it. So let's do the secret level. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot this is the secret level you unlock. Oh, joy! Yeah, this level is pretty, pretty not fun. <laughs> um, yeah, it's not as bad as it's um, in Central as you come to part, but it's still pretty horrendous. That shall be a sign of things to come. Right. Oh, oh, oh boy. Oh, good lord. That specific jump being so annoying. Oh yeah, I think for some of them you have to find the destroy all nitro crates to do. I think I'll just do that before. Just get all the regular boxes that aren't near nitro crates and then I'll come back and do the rest of it when I find that other crate. Yeah. I remember the insane trilogy vision of this level would give me quite a lot of grief. Oh boy, the shack. Or not. Son of a <laughs> Oh, whoa. Get his back turned to me. Ugh. Oh, we'll come back to that area. Okay. 